Hi guys, Steve Paul Fapes here. Um, sorry I haven't been around for a while. We've got a bit of having many, many, many things to do, including social lives and all that kind of thing. But we're back and we're going to be doing quite a few, uh, few reviews now on a, on a regular basis. We've got lots coming up this week. Um, first one we're going to start with though is the something from Elements. Um, and it's this one here, um, Strawberry Whip by Elements. They come in two, well, they come in various sizes, but the two that we've got are two lovely sizes. We've got these lovely, look at that, look at that for, for a bottle. Awesome idea, Elements uh, bottle, 125 mil. I'll show you some close was that, um, so you can have a look at it. We've also got the 20 mil bottle of Strawberry Whip. They both these are Strawberry Whip. So Strawberry Whip, it's a blend of strawberries and cream and it's meant to bring out the kind of uh, cakey feeling to it. Um, for me though, I get more of a kind of um, milkshake kind of flavor, um, more along the lines of something you'd expect from a strawberry milkshake from McDonald's. Um, but it's very, very good though. Uh, so these are 80-20, this is their dripper range. They do have another range, which I believe is 50-50, but this is the 80-20. This is three milligram. Um, so yeah, let's see how it performs. Let's get up close. Okay guys, so here I am, we're loading up the, uh, the CLT version 3, which I managed to pick up from um, Shady Vaping in Birmingham. Lads down there, very, very good customer service there. They knew exactly what we were looking for. Um, this was an up They recommend this as an upgrade to the Dark Horse, more eerie, and um, they're not wrong. And uh, yeah, and then we've got it on top of the Snow Wolf. Uh, it's a 0.3 Jewel Clapton build. Uh, so yeah, let's see what it chucks. Amazing. Flavour, even on that kind of airflow, is still very prominent. Uh, a lot of strawberries, lots of cream coming through. Like I say, it's more like a milkshake from McDonald's, a strawberry milkshake. It's very, very tasty. Um, unless you've got a, a, a decent bank account, uh, I wouldn't be looking into Elements. They are quite pricey. Uh, a 20 mil bottle starts at 12.99 on their website. Uh, I have found cheaper places. Uh, Grey Haze in uh, Nottingham. They're selling them for 9.99. Even Grey Haze online is 9.99. Uh, there's another store in Nottingham. Uh, it's a new company. I'm, I'm not too sure of the name, so you have to forgive me. But it's um, there. It's uh, 12.99 for a bottle or two bottles for 20. So same price essentially. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to turn the airflow down on this. Let's get the airflow right down, which is a bit of a pain. So one slot. Um, see how it does on one slot. Okay, so much more flavour. Really, really tasty down on one slot. Um, a bit warmer, but even as a warm vape, it's it's very um, very nice. Um, flavour still stays; it doesn't disappear with the uh, with the heat. Very, very good juice from Elements. I was lucky enough to go to the Vape Expo this weekend and went to the Elements stand and managed to try the whole range and all of their range is very good. A um, couple of flavors that weren't for me. However, on a whole, the range was of very good quality. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's brilliant to be fair. These are now my, my favorite liquid, if I'm being honest. However, trying to stay impartial, but um, yeah, if you if you get a chance to try some elements, try their juices. They are extremely good. Uh, so coming up this week, then we've got um, Sir Dale Wilkinson, the Yorkshire Vapor. He's sending me a couple of his new ones. Uh, we've got uh, Snooker Loopy coming, and that's like a Fruit Loops. Uh, I'll be honest with you, I have tried it. I love it, and I went and ordered the first 100 ml bottle. Apparently, according to Dale. Um, it is, it's very good. It's up there with Fruit Loops, uh, sorry, Looper, and those kind of stuff. If you put Looper and a Snooker Loopy side by side, you could tell Looper, um, but Snooker Loopy is a very, very, very close um, Looper. Um, yeah, and it's considerably cheaper than the original Looper. Um, but it's a very, very good vape. It's, um, for me, Dale has, with, with this one, he's upped his game a lot and I like the Yorkshire Vapor juices but this has gone yeah this is really gone ballistic so you really need to try um, Snooker Loopy from the Yorkshire Vapor. Uh, 
So what else have we got this week? Um, we've got a couple more elements coming up. These I'm really, can't wait to show off. King's Reserve. Tried these at the Vape Expo, very, very tasty. I'm gonna get down and dirty with it and um, show you what it's all about. Some Cosmic Fog. Mixed reviews I've heard on this, so we'll probably leave this till the end of the week. It's not a Friday night vape though. Um, so yeah, that's the things we've got coming up. If you've got any questions or queries, get in touch. I'll put some links below for the Yorkshire Vapor so you can go and check them out. Um, check out some of these juices. I'll put a link for Elements for you so you can go and check them out. Um, apart from that, guys, um, that's it for now. So take it easy. Um, be safe. Don't be sorry. And um, we'll see you soon. Cheers, guys.